is CLL diagnosed? Absolutely. So for most patients, um, CLL is diagnosed after a routine blood test shows a high white blood cell count. That's kind of the most common way that we find people entering into our clinic. Um, other things that people can notice is they have lumps or bumps that they've felt in their neck or under their armpits. Um, those are some other symptoms that can lead to the diagnosis. But often once a patient finds that their white blood cell count is, is high, um, some additional testing is done and the diagnosis of CLL is made. What are some common symptoms of CLL? You mentioned the lumps and bumps. Yeah. So Often in early stages, the lumps and bumps in, in the neck are the most common that people recognize, but fevers or chills, night sweats where patients are waking up drenched, having to change their pajamas, or weight loss without trying are some other symptoms that um, can raise some alarm bells and make, pe make people start looking for, for something. And CLL can be a diagnosis that can be found through that as well. Mm -hmm.